All right, so somebody asked if a short guy can get girls, and here's my response. Um, look, I'm just going to be honest. Off, off riff, shorter guys do have a disadvantage. Girls, no matter where they are in the world, from all cultures, from my experience, they want a taller guy. That's just a given. So, that I mean, that's a reality, right? So short guys do have a disadvantage. However, though, the upside is... Look at, you know, Kevin Hart, for example. Um, you have to ma- maximize in other areas of your life. So that's fitness, that's wealth, that's charisma, that's experience. Uh, you have to add something to the table. So Because if you're just like a short guy and, you know, out of shape, has no money, doesn't travel, doesn't know anything, like doesn't have any cool experiences, yeah, you're not going to get any girls. And then you're going to be at an even, even worse severe disadvantage. Look, life is not fair. Everyone, um, some people are dealt a better hand than others. Um, As a guy, you just have to accept that. So, as I mentioned, even though you do have a disadvantage being a short guy, I still have seen, because I've traveled the world, and I've seen short guys with beautiful women, um, and clearly there's, you know, they have something else or multiple other facets that they maximize wealth, they dress sharp, um, they're in shape, maybe they have some status, they're world class at what they do. So as a short guy, quote unquote, not even quote unquote, but as like a legitimate short guy, uh, that's just what you have to do. You cannot have this victim mindset because if you have this victim mindset and you say that, okay, I'm short, I'm not going to do anything about it, your situation is not going to improve, you're going to get bitter, and as time goes on, you're just going to be even angrier Whereas you should accept the reality and just maximize all other areas of your life. And then I'll add, uh, if you are a shorter guy, then go to other countries where they tend to be shorter. That's some places in Asia and South America that come off the top of my head. That doesn't mean that you can't date in North America or in Europe, but typically uh, people are shorter in Asia and South America. So you may have more options possibly in those areas. But again, uh, you still need to maximize the other areas in your life. Just because they're shorter doesn't mean that you can't do anything about it. doesn't mean that it's just going to work out for you. No, that's the opposite. You still, no matter where you're at, you need to maximize other areas of your life. So guys, if you want anything similar in terms of questions or you want to uh, request a topic, I'm going to leave my email in the description. Um, send your question and I'll answer it and anything else please let me know with that thanks for watching the video please like and subscribe to the channel and I'll talk to you guys in the next one bye